Welcome! In front of me I have Asus Zen Watch 2 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing we need to do is to wake up or rather turn on our watch. To do it, press and hold the side button and keep holding it until you see the Asus logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can release the button and wait until the watch turns on. After the watch turns on, you probably will see the welcome message on the screen. You can swipe left on the screen to open the list of languages and here you can scroll through the list, find the language you would like to use on your watch. Once you find it, tap on it to select it. Come on. No, the watch froze for a second. Let's wait. Okay. Now we can swipe left. And as you can see, we need to download and install the uh, Android Wear, but now it's called Wear OS application. So go to your iPhone, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the App Store, tap on search, tap on the search bar and type in uh, Wear OS. No, oh, my bad, not Pro OS. Like this. And you should see this application, Wear OS by Google. We need to download it, so let's tap on it, tap on the Get button. And after the application is done installing, you can tap on Open to open it. In the app, you will see this page. Now tap on Start Setup, Agree, Enable, Allow, and the app will start searching for the nearby devices. It should detect your Asus, Z Asus Zen Watch 2. Tap on it to select it. Then tap on pair. And you can allow or deny the permission for the notifications. This is useful if you want to receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. If you don't care, you can deny it. Here tap on continue and you can allow the calendar access if you want to. And then we can tap on continue and allow the notifications again uh, if you want to receive them on your watch. Then tap on done. And you should see your Asus Zen Watch 2 on the, in the app, basically. It's going to update for a couple more minutes, so I'm not going to wait, but basically that's how you put the devices together. After the watch is done updating, it's going to basically turn on, or rather, log into a system and you can use it. And that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.